Michi, erzähl mir doch mal eine Geschichte von den Borderlands. Das würde ich gerne tun, Fritz, aber die kenne ich noch nicht, deswegen spielen wir die jetzt in Let's Play Tales from the Borderlands. Ihr habt es euch schon richtig gedacht, wie die spielen alle Borderlands-Spiele und wie die spielen alle Telltale-Spiele, dann könnt ihr das doch nicht auslassen. Denn ich habe mir sagen lassen, das ist ziemlich gut und deswegen holen wir das jetzt nach. Das Ganze ist ein Episoden-Adventure, also ein bisschen wie die Walking Dead oder wie die Wolf Among Us-Spiele oder eben auch Game of Thrones und es erzählt die Geschichte von Borderlands nach Teil 2 weiter und es geht um diese beiden Gesellen, weil wer das ist, das werden wir jetzt rausfinden und ich sage einfach mal, äh, Feuer frei. Das Spiel gibt es übrigens, falls ihr euch äh, wundert und ärgert, leider äh, bislang nur mit englischer Sprachausgabe und englischen Untertiteln. Back again to hear another story of immense fortune and unthinkable peril. Well, I have some time. The borderlands of Pandora were told to contain mysterious alien treasure troves filled with advanced technology and incredible power. Vaults, the people called them. And to seek one out was to earn you the title of Vault Hunter. At least by me. You could say Handsome Jack was one such explorer, though his methods could be seen as uh, somewhat unsporting. He ran the corporation Hyperia and died trying to claim Pandora as his own. History's attention is fickle, my friends. It will remember those pirates like Handsome Jack, but forget the adventurers who risk it all for less, ah, uh, obvious rewards. Stories, legends, those are much better at getting at the real spirit of things. Stories remember both sides of the tale. Hast du schon was? Nö. Das ist noch ein Film. Jetzt muss eigentlich gleich wieder so ein Viech überfahren werden. some sort of radiation leak I don't know about <laughs> <laughs> Exactly, are we going? I ask the questions. Okay, then uh, do you mind asking yourself where you're taking me? <laughs> <laughs> oh! Ow. <laughs> Ow, what the hell? Tell me about the Gordas project. <laughs> is that what this is about? <laughs> Look. Gordas is bad business. If you want a real hot investment, I am on the ground floor of some property on E. Okay, 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 okay. Don't be a smartass. I'm not a patient person. So just start talking. Just where do you start when you're getting dragged through the desert and, uh... From the beginning. Right. Hmm. <laughs> Ja, mir fällt total gut, dass das mehr in Richtung Western geht, mhm. was irgendwie in den Borderlands Shootern ja nicht so ja. stark war. I guess it all started with a promotion. See, I'd spent my entire career up at Hyperion, so I suppose that makes me one of the bad guys in this story. 
And Handsome Jack, he was the you baddest guy of them all. This long. It must feel good I to wanted to be rabbit, just you know? like him. Take it. It's yours, right? <laughs> I mean, you always <laughs> said that. Everyone did. I gotta be honest, I always thought it was sort of cheesy, but, uh, but hey, here Which we are. Which resulted in a company overflowing with assholes. <laughs> <laughs> Animals. When Handsome Jack died, it somehow got even worse. It took some time to fit in. But a few stabs and select backs, a new haircut, and the help of a couple friends, I was on my way to get the promotion that was going to change my life. Scratch that. Our lives for the better. I was a little distracted. It was a big day for us. Luckily, Vaughn was concentrating on the important things. What's the first thing you're gonna buy? I know what Henderson's making. I do his payroll. <laughs> if you're getting a fraction of what he earns, you'll be rolling in it. There are a couple sweet rides I've been looking at. More fitting of the position I'm gonna be in. Where the hell would you even drive that thing? We're in space. I wouldn't actually use it. It would be... More for looks. <laughs> oh, right. Well, then that's a great idea. We're meeting with a vet afterward to celebrate. She booked us a table. Yep. Sounds good. Look, we had to do a lot of awful stuff to get you to this point. Do I regret some of it? Sure I do. Every night it haunts my dreams, but that doesn't matter now. Because you made it. You deserve this, man. And don't ever think you don't. And don't ever think about the Iridium Mine deal we put together. Those people have to work somewhere, right? You're damn right I deserve it. I earned this. Well, Yvette and I did contribute. Right. Sure, you... You help some. <laughs> Alright, man. Let's get that Hyperion face on. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> uh, fake smile? Augenbrauer <laughs> hoch. Oh, we need some condescending. It's a little too friendly right now. Okay, tell you what. Tilt your head back. Uh, like if you ask me if there's anything up your nose. How's that? There you go. <laughs> you don't respect me at all. Perfect. <laughs> Mr. Henderson? Have a seat, Reese. I'll just be a second. No, I wasn't talking to you. Yes, I'm talking to you now. Yeah, but I don't want it as red. I want it black. Because black is better. Look, don't concern yourself with why, okay, Jerry? Concern yourself with how. And just send the car over when it's ready. Company car. Didn't even have to ask. <laughs> you look surprised to see me, Reese. And if I'm reading the situation right, and I usually am, you're not too happy about it either. This all came together quick. So, you might not have been in the loop. So where's Henderson? He, uh, stepped out. You're going to be reporting to me now, Reese. And I want you to know the promotion that you worked so hard to get. That's still coming to you. Well, that's a relief. <laughs> Cause I... But this is about more than that, Reese. It's about your future in this company. Look, you want to know the reason why I'm in that chair and you're not? For the exact same reason why North is North, why the handsome guy always gets the girl, and why every spaceship in the universe is shaped like a cock. <laughs> <laughs> it's destiny, race. And men, real men, men like me, make their own. And you could hold a grudge if you like. No harm, no foul, your thoughts are your own. But bad things can happen when you swim against fate. Sometimes men find themselves standing oh. in the way of other men's lives. <laughs> you don't want to be that man. Wow. I could not have timed that better. <laughs> Which is this. This promotion is going to take you out of the way of other people's destiny. And put you on your own path. And that, my friend, is why I am promoting you to... Jerry, why isn't my new car digistructing in my office yet? Vasquez, it's August. 
Oh, August. Uh, cool, listen. I actually have somebody here with me, so... Uh... Are you buying this vault key, or what? Because I... How did this happen so quick? I thought I'd have more time. Of course I'm still interested. I... Yes, I'm near a computer. Ten million. Yeah. It's just that's a lot of money to get together on short notice. I mean, I'm not trying to be obstinate, but I need time. Oh, kids got time. Ein klassischer Fight inzwischen. Ja, ja, no, but. Warte mal. Das ist ein Echo Eye. Warte mal. Three years sucking up to the guy. Do you want the money or no? Because I. Wo ist das? Wo das Echo Eye? LB. Achso. Ah, guck mal. It's not. No, it won't be a big deal for me to get. <lacht> Ain't no bang. <lacht> Aber vielleicht kannst du den. Ja, das war was wir hatten. Ah. It's a working day, August. And I just got this promotion. Ja, das ist so geil, wie das alles hm. im Borderlands-Style ist. Nur komischerweise denke ich halt jede Sekunde jetzt ein Splash vorbei und wir müssen anfangen zu kämpfen. Just wait there, okay? I can only be down it. If it's gonna be 10 million dollars, I'm gonna need another hour or two. Okay, yeah, I'll be there in a bit. Well then just stay there. It's a tourist shop, right? Buy a mug or something. Sure, sure, sure. Okay, say out of your mouth. Damn it! Ah, right. Now, what were we talking about? Before we were so rudely interrupted. Vault key, B. Uh, I think it was something about buying a vault key, right? Oh, just like that. Buying a vault key, right? <laughs> You're like a kid sounding out the words. All right, your uh, promotion. Henderson was a fool. He didn't know his place. He needed lesson number one. Humility. But you, I respect you, Reese. That's why I'm going to make you assistant vice janitor. <laughs> <laughs> What? No, no, you, you, you can't. I'm the boss now, Reese. I do whatever I want. Report to Sewage Scout 23. Effective immediately. You better get an eye installed in the back of your head. Because you, you never know when I could be creeping up behind you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm your boss, Reese. Get used to that. This is what I'm talking about when I say humility. That was lesson number two. Don't make lesson number three about a number two. What? Don't make me crap on the floor and make you clean it up! <laughs> <laughs> You're dismissed, Reese. I'll let you know when I need my trash can emptied. Patrick Warburton heißt er, glaube ich. Der Sprecher. <lacht> Und er ist doch wieder Troy Bakes. Wer jetzt What the hell was that? He can't do this to us. He just did. No, no, no. This can't be happening. I'm finished, Bob. I'm finished. You know this place is. There's blood in the water, and everyone can smell it. No, no, no. They can't. Not yet. Unless you don't quiet down. We just gotta. Sorry, you were saying something. I interrupted you. Reese, why are you cleaning up trash? I thought you were getting a promotion. Trash bad. duty seems like the opposite of a promotion. Henderson's dead. What? Are you sure? Yeah. 
I mean, you can ask him yourself. He's floating outside in space! It's that prick Vasquez. <sighs> he threw Henderson out of an airlock and demoted Reese to trash man. Holy crap. So, does that mean you're not buying? <laughs> well, just trying to lighten the mood. And I didn't bring my wallet, so if someone pays for me... I'll tell you who's gonna pay. <laughs> Vasquez. I don't know if he's the type we to... We can't let that prick get away with this. We need to do something. He just killed a guy. Maybe it's better we lay low for a bit. We're gonna ruin his career. How do you plan on doing that? Yeah. Vasquez set up a deal on Pandora for a vault key. Whoa. A vault key? Uh-huh. I'm sure he promised a die period. That must be why he got the promotion. The only thing Hyperion cares about more than money is his vault keys. It's perfect! I mean, not only do we screw over Asquez, we have a friggin' vault key! What are they worth? Like a billion dollars? More. Yeah, but we need ten million dollars right now to make the deal. Hold, please. Done. What? <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. That was impressive. <laughs> I mean, accounting. I mean, it's what I do. Ten million bucks is chump change around here. By the time anyone notices, we'll have a vault key. Cool. Well, looks like you boys got it all figured out. I'm gonna go eat. Alone? Call me if you don't get killed, Whoa, 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 right? hey, hey, we need your help. We need clearance, transportation. You're a requisitions master. We need that stuff. Yeah, maybe a loader bot or two. You know, things get dicey. Look, it's one thing stealing from a bunch of poor suckers on Pandora. You're talking about stealing from Hyperion. But we're friends! Friends help each other steal stuff. I mean, that's how it works. Richter used to steal candy bars. His family still doesn't know where the body is. Come on, Yvette. We're in this together. One of us moves up, we all move up. <laughs> yeah, and by that same logic, in some way, we all just got demoted to janitor. Do you really want that? Vasquez really screwed us, didn't he? Fine. But I'm still hungry. No problem. We only got a couple of hours. <sighs> Go withdraw the cash. I'll get you guys clearance to Pandora, get you geared up, and issue you a standard Hyperion town car. What? Standard? Really? You can't spring for premium? Seat warmers, maybe a convertible or something? Sure, yeah, a convertible. So, just so I got this straight, you want me to get you a car to drive around Pandora that leaves you less protected, right? Look, it just... If you're gonna steal something, I uh, figure... No. No, don't worry. I've got a car in mind. <laughs> Klauen Sie den Vasquez. Ja, klar. Supercar. <lacht> Holy freaking crap, what was that? What? 
What do we even? Oh, what do we even why? hit? Why? Oh, I hope that wasn't like why a really ugly do? person. <laughs> <laughs> oh, crap. I think we. I think we killed it. Are we murderers now? We're, we're murderers. We're murderers. Great, great. We murder. Relax, Vaughn. It's a skag. They breed like hostile rabbits down here. Still, it's kind of sad. Yeah. Kind of. Uh oh. So, what do we say if someone asks where we got the money? What do you mean? Well, I mean, what do we tell people? We should have a story. I would prefer not to tell them that we stole it from Hyperion. That would not go over well. We can just say it's for charity. <laughs> what does that even mean? We say it's uh, some sort of open a vault for Pandorans kind of thing. It's <laughs> <laughs> attached to a charity. They hardly ever question their intentions. So, this looks not good. We got ourselves a hero here! What are you looking at? It's Pandora. What did you expect? Yeah, no, I know. I, I guess I'm just now more acutely aware that I have ten million dollars chained to me is all. In a neighborhood, I might add, of back planet nut jobs. Just keep your eyes open for the place, okay? I don't want to be here any longer than we have to. Yeah. And uh, watch the money. Oh, really? Listen, <laughs> one tap on the arm, and Yvette can send down a loader bot if things get too entertaining. That's true. And she gave me this. It is a stun baton. I do not know how it works. It's <laughs> definitely neat. Yeah, <laughs> stick. Neato. God, I can't wait to be in that chair. You and me, a vet. I mean, we bring this key back, and they're gonna make us the once and future kings of that place for sure. They'll send in a crew to use the key, and then that's it. Don't think so small, my friend. We're not just gonna run Hyperion. We're gonna be responsible for plundering a vault. And you can count on two fingers the number of people who have even gotten close to that. Yeah. Zu sehen vorne an dem Auto, das Haar. Mhm. Wie nicht zersprengt. The tracker's beep beep beeping, but I don't see the place. It's the world of curiosities, right? Yeah, do you see it? No. Could ask one of them. They seem normal-ish. Or you could ask one of them. You're the closer, right? So close. Get us some direction. Ja, dann äh, schauen wir mal, wie es weitergeht in der nächsten Folge. Ich bin jedenfalls schon mal sehr positiv überrascht. Bisher super cool. Bis zum nächsten Mal. Ciao. Ciao.